All right, hey guys, welcome back to Salt's Ultimate Iron Man series. Uh, in this one, I'm definitely going to try to finish the Guardians of the Rift grind, but uh, we're going to start this one off here with Tears of Gothic, since uh, I think I was slacking and forgot once again to do this. I don't remember what day it was supposed to be last week, but uh, yeah, oops. Yeah, could have been worse, but uh, definitely a bit better well, there's another little bit of progress on my lowest freaking skill what am i doing oh where are you where are you going all right so that's that now i'm gonna head on back to guardians of the rift this time i actually have my chisel honestly though i don't know that i really care to have the chisel um in these mass worlds like I kind of would rather have the inventory space to be completely honest all right so I actually do have enough pearls here to buy the boots so I'm gonna go ahead and get those so that's pretty cool at least uh this we have the first piece of our outfit here so it's going to cost me another 700 1100 so Still got quite a ways to go. I'm going to take a guess and say that I'll probably get like 85 for crafting out of this because I'm just not getting particularly lucky with these pearls. Uh, and I'm also not really pulling as many points as like you possibly could. I'm sure I'm not doing this like the most optimal way possible, but it is what it is. Um, it's the way it goes. <laughs> Ultimate Iron Man life for you. I've seen a... Uh couple people and I was doing this myself for a bit um, if you uh, have the menu entry swapper this will automatically be quick pass instead which is rather irritating what you want to do is go into the menu entry swapper here and you don't want to have quick pass open start travel any of these uh, you don't want this ticked it makes it so that you will double click and you will walk in and walk right back out and screw yourself out and of a game it's really annoying happened to me a lot of times so i figured it out um so yeah make sure that you have this disabled if you guys are using the menu entry swapper if you don't then it's like this by default i believe so i just missed the level because i'm dumb um well, there's AD Greencrafting. That really feels bad that I missed that freaking dialogue. But, um, ADRC now, so just smithing and prayer are below 80 now, so we're getting close to base 80s. Also, grats to my buddy Black Magic for getting his, uh, DH set a thousand KC less than me. Fuck you, dude. But, grats. And I get lucky. Just give me the pearls. I don't really care about the rest of the stuff. Just pearls, please. Oh, there's the catalytic talisman. Cool. Honestly, I was thinking about this. Um, I might honestly go to map two. I know it's a little, kind of a little, little bit worrisome for me, but like, I think realistically, I might honestly just do it. Okay, I'm gonna have to go and clean up my inventory. Um, I'm gonna think about this. I'm actually gonna go have dinner right now. I'm gonna think about this. It means I'm gonna have to get rid of my pouches and have to get them again, but. I mean, honestly, that's not a half bad idea. I should have just dropped these mind talismans as well. Oh, well. But, um, yeah, I'll give this some thought. Objectively, I think this is the way to go. Just getting up to done. Be a couple extra more. I think it's two quest points. That would be pretty, uh, pretty nice. And that's a pain in the ass quest out of the way. And then I can just use Song of the Elves whenever. But I'll think about it. Haven't decided anything just yet. I'm going to go and eat and figure this out. All right, so we're going to do this abysmal quest. Oh, my, yeah. Okay, so I've got to get a mourner set again, apparently. That's unfortunate. <laughs> it's been that long since I did um, Morning's End Part 1, I think. Uh, that was. I did that. I'm pretty sure I did that quest before the armor cases and all that got reworked to where uh, mahogany and above store unlimited amount. Or, well, every set, basically. So, that sucks. I'm going to have to go and get that again. Uh, not, a, not a fan of that. So, I'm going to have to 
go ahead and do all that lovely fun stuff. Um, I'm actually going for this. I'm going to swap out to a uh, lunar staff. Um, the uh, Draman staff here is great, except that I want to have prayer bonus uh, where I can get it. <laughs> Holy, that scared the hell out of me. Oh, my apple hurts in that butt clutch. Am I going to succeed in going across here? Nice. Well, that was hell, but, um, yeah. Nice. And you? <laughs> Not doing that shit? And can I... There we go. Okay, yeah, I'm done. And just one thing to verify every time... <laughs> I have left this crystal, or this uh, mirror turned the other way before, and I, it's not fun. So, indeed, this is the way it should be. So now we can gedaddle. And that is that. I didn't realize it was 60,000 Agile XP, holy hell. Alright, well, there's that. And now, basically, I think that's all the quests that I... Oh, I can do contact still. Um, but basically, that's... I think aside from contact, I think that's every quest that I can do that does not have some spooky fight that I'm not really interested in doing. Okay, the last thing I need to do, actually, is... Uh, now that I've done map 2, uh, I can turn this talisman into a tiara. So I'm going to get rid of my graceful hood here. And, well, I'm not going to get rid of it, but I'm... Gonna throw it into my storage there. I believe this needs a gold tiara, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not sure how that's exactly supposed to be imbued. Guess we'll figure it out. But I know I need a tiara mold, and I'm gonna have to go back to Lumbridge and grab my pickaxe again. Actually, uh, no, I'm gonna go ahead and just get my uh, rune pick back because uh, we're gonna go back to Guardians of the Rift later sometime here that's the next thing i be uh, that i'll be doing see what all do i need to do for the already hard diary oh well that sucks i don't have <laughs> gonna have to get a palm tree seed i guess i could have used the uh catalytic tiara um it did pass and apparent according to the wiki uh it can be used now but i didn't want to risk it um but that's if you guys are wondering why i didn't make this to a tiara before the quest and save myself an inventory space that's why what's the easiest to get to i guess the um body altar is probably the easiest for me to get to and there's that all right very cool so we've got our catalytic catalytic tiara so i don't have to lug that thing around in my inventory anymore and now I'm just running to Varrock. I'm going to grab my Varrock armor again. Yeah, okay. So I've got a banana tree. Yeah, that's uh, not a palm tree. So it feels bad, but I'll uh, have to hope I get a palm tree seed soon. Because it would be nice to finish the RD uh, hard diary. So f the reason I'm holding on to the catalytic tiara here is because I'll use this on the hat of the eye. And that, um, I think it's called Hat of the Eye. Yeah, Hat of the Eye. Um, and I can basically use the, I'll have the effects of the catalytic, catalytic tiara inside of the Hat of the Eye. Which I think would be really, really beneficial to me on here. I don't know if it retains that effect after it's stored in the house, but we'll find out. But better to give it the chance to work than, uh not have the chance at all Alrighty, let's see what we can get out of these few points i've got here uh, oh i got the needle cool and there is 81 rune crafting so we should have about 60 pulls to do please for the love of god can i get some pearls come on keep them coming okay well that's a real freaking troll I don't really envision myself dying my set. Uh, maybe I'll come back someday and do it, but not gonna happen anytime soon. So I'm just gonna go ahead and exchange this.
The problem is, is that that's such a f***ing troll, dude. <laughs> I need one singular f***ing pearl. Oh, that's so irritating, dude. Oh my god, come on. <laughs> it's so f***ing annoying. Uh, I'm gonna go try to do this hard clue and hopefully we can complete it. I'm gonna wait to open these guys because they can give me more, so. Ah, shocker of shockers. Oh, okay, well there's the second D met on the account. <laughs> That's interesting. Yes, okay. <laughs> uh, of course. Uh, let me spam this. Uh, let me in, let me in. Yes. All right. <laughs> let me, uh, hang on. Okay. Hold up. Let me stand here. And now we take this guy off. Yep. Perfect. And check. Check that again because I'm blind. Okay. Cool. Now we have hat with catalytic talisman uh, power, basically. So now this gets to go away. Goodbye. Oh, cool. Another red die. That's great. And there is 82 rune crafting. Uh, oh, actually, that's that's a, a helpful one if I ever wanted to craft astrals for whatever reason. I would guess I'll probably get to like 84 by the time I finish this outfit. Again, I don't really care. Uh, I would prefer the less XP, the better. I just want to get this done as quick as possible. Get this freaking outfit done so I can craft bloods to 99. You gotta be shitting me. This is ridiculous. This is why these games fail. This, this is like, how brain dead are people that they can't place these? Like, it's not even that difficult. Like, what the f God, it's irritating. And I don't have a damn chisel, so of course I can't make these freaking uh, guardians. It's, this is just dumb. Like, what the hell is the matter with people? Like, no barriers, no f***ing f***ing idiots. Alright. 48 pulls to do. Let's, let's do this. Give me those pearls. I don't care about anything else. Just pearls. Just pearls. Come on, pearls. For the love of God, give me pearls. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh huh. All right. Yeah. I still haven't gotten any pearls, though, dude. Come on. Please? Pearls? Let's go. One day I'll be 85 and I can use that on there, but. Um. Willy step. Shocker. Every time. I think that they just come from here with like 90% chance to be willy steps. Okay. Well, not exactly what I was hoping for, but all right. I'm going to hopefully get my last pearls here so I can get my freaking root bottom. I don't think I'm going to be able to pull it in. Hopefully I got eight points. Thank you. I don't really envision myself pulling it in this, but we can try. Please? Oh, thank Jesus. Alright. There's my rope bottom. Feels good, man. Almost done. The end is in sight. The light is at the end of the tunnel and it's getting a little brighter. Not much, but a little bit. Oh, look, 83. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm sorry about that. I forgot to restart my screen recording. So uh, I have the live commentary, but I ended up herping a giant derp and not having the video. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to do my best here to hopefully line up relate screenshots with my live commentary at the moment. Uh, we'll see what happens out of that. Hopefully that'll that'll work.
Okay, well, uh, let me just run you guys through really fast since I was not recording my screen since I went to check my XP. Uh, somebody pulled a pet. I was hoping that was me that trolled me, but then I pulled a lantern and AP grabs me. Then I pulled the locket out of the, uh, are they called intricate pouches? Oh, oh, hello. That's the, that's the, ooh, ooh. ooh nice. Okay, well, I'm I'm actually pretty happy about that, uh, to be honest. I need to figure out how to f use that. One second. Uh, tarnished, tarnished, shit. tarnished locket. And then I take it to the Lumbridge Guide. Yes. So there's that. And then, um, so I'm running to Lumbridge. And I'm going to go ahead of here and uh, get my uh, goodies. So now I have unlimited teleports to presumably to the temple itself. We'll find out. I uh, just have to yeet some items here to my main account. Really fast. Okay, so Spicy. Very nice. Teleports are right here. That's actually could in the future be a fairly useful teleport we'll see uh that gets me to an essence mine really fast so i guess that's that's pretty good actually that's my fastest way to get to an essence mine at the moment i think pretty cool i really want this to be over <sighs> oh my god come on come on <sighs> Oh, yeah, another game where nobody's doing anything useful. Excellent. Good stuff. All right, time to see here. I'm just going to every game out and come back in because uh, we'll know until we uh, pass. Won't know if I can pull the pearls. Hey, there it is. We're done. So that's it. We are done. We're free. We are free. Don't buy the wrong thing, salt. Roped up. And that is that. Oh. Uh, so we got 553 rift searches, 186 closes, 1,350 pearls. It does look like it indeed did uh, count the pearls for items that I turned in. Um, cause, yeah, that's the amount of points for the set, I think. So, uh, didn't get the lost bag, didn't, obviously I didn't buy the ring of the elements, and I didn't get the pet or the guardian eye, so, uh, and I didn't get any of the blue or green dyes, but I don't really give a shit. <laughs> I'm... Freaking elated to be done. Uh, we're gonna skedaddle from here, and then it's... I think it's off to MTA, actually. Um, I gotta edit this week's video right now, but... Uh, once I do that... Actually, I did want to do one thing, though. Uh, before we do anything else... Um... Can I even do that? Uh, let's see, Falador Elite air, air runes, 252 air runes, I'm going to try to do it, I have no idea if it's going to be possible, um, I will not need these rune pouches for anything more, uh, unless I ever go back to Guardians of the Rift, um, to the dick, also known as Dick's house, also known as my POH. Woo! Yes, I do fancy an exam. Let me just finish killing this asshole first. Quick, huh? Oh, get the air talisman. Cool. Oh, yes, I do. Uh -huh. Yep, that's a fish. And that's uh, definitely the speed. 
Uh, oh, that's it. Oh, I want a beer. Let's go. Give me the. Give me one of those beers. Or the cocktail. Take. The, uh, hey, you know what? No, I prefer a beer. Take a beer over a freaking cocktail. Uh, that's some nice, easy prayer XP. Give me that. And now we skid all back to my house. So I'm not actually sure if I will be able to do this. We'll find out. I have no idea if this is actually doable, guys. Uh, this was this is gonna be a learning experience for all of us. I have not done any of the math to, to figure out whether this is doable. I'm just gonna send it and see what happens. All right, so here we are. And nice, cool. All right, so there's that. And then out these runes. I think I'm just gonna beat the shit out of this uh, wizard here instead of you know s screwing around in the abyss. So I'll uh, hopefully get this within a few kills. All right, there's the earth talisman. I also was cheeky and picked up some runes, so I don't have to run. I'll restore my energy at my house here. So there's the elite Varrock uh, task done. So we don't have any more runecrafting tasks I can do until 92. And that is the, I think that's 56 nature runes uh, at once for the elite uh, Karamja diary. But that ain't gonna happen. I don't know what the f yet. I'm a dumbass, I dropped me. Oh, this is gonna be painful. I just did something dumb, guys. I dropped the runes in here, and there's going to be like 20 stacks of runes. Which one are mine? Is it this stack? Yes. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> that would have been fun. <laughs> oh, that would have been a very sad walk back to my house. I think we're going to go ahead here, guys. I'm going to get my, my uh, runes out here for MTA. So I need to... Uh, empty this for a minute and collect here I'm just going to grab whatever runes I've got because it's, you know, these runes are going to just actually, I think I might leave my deaths now that I think about that but I'm going to need my my uh, chaos runes here because i got to get on the onyx I'm going to leave my bloods and my souls in, I think and You guys know what's up now. <laughs> the element of surprise, I think, is is over. But, um, yeah, we're going to go ahead here. And I'm going to get everything that I need in order to make my fury. Uh, I do need to go back to my house again. Uh, I need to get some fire rooms because I forgot that I don't have a tome of fire anymore. I was trying to figure out why do I have any fire runes. I'm like, oh, right. And let me go sell off a bunch of chaos runes here. I'm getting getting close to the uh, the point where I go grab cash stack. Actually, you know what? Yeah, no, we're there. Good enough. I'm not... I'm just... Eh. So frustrating running around like, oh, yeah, you need to charter or use the boat to go from Artie to... Uh, Grimhaven, it's like, ah, yeah, coins, what are those? I'm used to having those in my inventory all the time, and I don't even think of them existing. Right. All right, so I showed this in my last video, I think. Yeah, I'm 99% sure. I'm going to show you guys, uh, for those of you that either didn't watch my last video, or, I don't know. For those of you that aren't aware of this, um, as I fail at moving items through my inventory, uh, I'm gonna basically gonna set these chaos runes here at the bottom of my inventory. I am going to make sure they don't actually attack anything, and we're gonna go uh, do that. We're gonna do this fixed layout, and then single mouse button mode. Oh god, it feels so weird. Uh, trade this guy, and those are my graceful gloves. So that means I'm, in fact, wearing my. Karamja gloves. 
And basically, I just sit here and spam click my fucking fingers off. And it shouldn't take too long, and I will have my Onyx. So I'll be back once I have the toggle done here. Alrighty, I accidentally sold 50 more than I needed to, I'm pretty sure, but there's that. Oh, I gotta get off this interface mode. I can't stand it. And get that the hell away. Okay. So now if I run here, hello, I would like an onyx, please. Okay, there's my onyx. Big day, guys, big day. All right, now to my house. And there is my onyx. In the amulet mold. Really? 86 mining is taking you that long with a rune pick to mine a gold ore? Really? Really, salt? Wow, okay. All right, Falador. This bloody freaking amulet, man. This is so long overdue. Pretty cool to be able to do this without boosting, though. Oh, and for those of you wondering, um, I'm going to show you guys this now, but literally I can get that back just like that. So that is, I guess, my fastest way to get a, to the uh, Renaissance mine, I guess. Uh, I think. Actually, I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty sure it is. Uh, not that that's particularly relevant, but hey, you never know. Okay, there's that. I am not running to the freaking spinning thingy. Alright. And... I'm not doing that because I don't want to use up all my runes. One sec, guys. <laughs> Boom. Amulet of Fury on the UIM. Nice. Very long overdue, like I said, but that is pretty f***ing spicy. Very, very, very happy about that. Ah, such a good feeling. Oh, right. I'm not done yet. No, I'm done. Nice. Ah, <laughs> oh, such a good feeling, and I can get rid of that. Drop that. And, uh, actually I'm gonna keep that in my inventory quickly here. Uh, I'll come back here and get my reins. I just wanna put my robes away while I, uh, I'd rather be wearing graceful. Okay, wait a second, why am I- hold on. Uh, oh my god, that's gonna be so annoying, Jog Flex. It's going to warn me because the boots don't get dyed. Oh, that's so fucking annoying. Jagex, come on. And, yeah, of course I can't go in there. You know, actually, that would be a good place for it, now that I think about it. Just make the thing go in here. Like, why not? Right? Like... That's, that's kind of a note, like, you can have the saw in here, you can have a freaking Bruma torch, which uh, I wish that I had kept one from Winter Todd, but I'll go back someday. Like, you can keep all that. Uh, yeah, you know what, you can keep a Bruma torch. A Bruma torch is more functionally useful than even this thing, like, outside of the mini game it belongs to. So, there you go, guys. There you go, Jagex. Make this thing storable in the Magic Wardrobe. Problem solved. You'll have me not bitching anymore about something that should be changed like that. Um, but in the shorter term of things here, let me get my inventory unjacked up again. Um, eh. 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 There. Okay, so there's that. Oh, that's such a nice feeling. Oh, looks so good. 
Okay, so I, uh, as I was going through my footage, I just realized something that I didn't check and I wanted to verify for you guys. So uh, let me pull this outfit set out quickly. And check this. Nice. Okay, so after you store the hat in the house, it does not lose what it's attuned to, uh, which TR it's attuned to. So that's excellent. That was the uh, the one concern that I had. So that's that's great. Alrighty. So <laughs> I've just been kind of hanging out here at Barb Fishing while I was editing the video. Managed to get close to 250,000 XP here, so that's pretty nice. Uh, I'll probably do this from now on when I'm editing videos, if I can, and obviously if my inventory will permit me to do this. Uh, my plans for next week is mainly to get my MTA grind done. I might also try to squeeze Barb Assault in there and finally get my torso and granite plate body. I really just want to get the rest of my minigame stuff done so I can focus solely on grinding out the big XP grinds towards maxing. If you enjoy my content, I'd really appreciate if you could drop a like on the video and consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't yet. If you have any feedback, feel free to leave a comment as I do read the comments. Anyways, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time. Take care of yourselves and stay safe.